Dear third semester civil stream students, I welcome you all into my another video. Hope you are all doing well and I know you are eagerly waiting for the passing package for this subject engineering geology. So I have uh, collected some super important questions for your particular subject. BCV303 is the subject code and uh, let me discuss over here first the passing modules. So first of all we have module 1 which is a passing module very easy. You can easily grab more than 15 marks by this much portion. If you are having the good luck then definitely 20 marks. So explain the role of geology in the civil engineering. What is plate tectonics? Explain different types of plate boundaries. Explain causes effects of earthquake. This is the super important question. Explain briefly the internal structure of the earth. Again, a super important one. And write short notes on tsunami causes and effects and landslides and its causes and remedial measures, cyclone and short notes on volcanic eruptions and uh, next one we have class by the minerals based on their physical properties last one we have discussed the internal and external uh, geodynamic process and controlling the internal factors so this is all about your module one which is passing module so next passing module is module second in which you have to go through these super important ones what is metamorphism explain the different kinds of metamorphism with example Describe the following rocks for its geological, physical and engineering properties and its suitability as building material materials. Uh, first one is granite and next one is limestone. Next to question we have here, describe the character of good building stones. And next one, what is a mineral? Describe the following physical properties of a mineral. Quartz, uh, hematite and gypsum. Next one we have uh, enumerate the classification of igneous rocks. Sixth one we have explained rock cycle. What is texture? Explain types of texture in igneous rocks. Seventh one we have explained various uses of different rock types. Write a short note on sedimentary rocks. So last one we have what are metamorphic rocks and its classification. So this is all about your module second. Coming to the module third which is again a passing module in which you have to cover these super important questions only that is what is weathering explain the types of weathering distinguish between black cotton soil and laterite soil super important one explain the effect of weathering on monumental rock again important explain soil formation and its profile explain the classification of soil based on their grain size next one we have write a short note on drifted soil and soil mineralogy and sixth one we have explained various types of soil so this is all about your module third so these three modules are the passing modules if you want to pass you have to cover these important portions from these particular modules if you want to score also you can refer these for two particular modules that is module four and module fifth so module four we have what is fault explain parts of fault discuss importance of folded structure in selection of dam site what is joint describe types of joints explain the impact of faults on dam and tunnel project what are the different types of rock deformations what is an outcrop write a note on a uh, dip and strike so next one we have described the types of borehole data commonly collected during sub subsurface investigations and if you are convenient with the problematic part go through problems on borehole data and and outcrop problems okay so next one we have module fifth now over here that is uh, define aquifer explain briefly the different types of uh, aquifer with neat sketch explain water bearing properties of rocks and explain the electric resistivity method for exploration of groundwater explain the factors affecting permeability of rocks explain porosity and types of porosity sixth one we have explained coefficient of permeability specific yield and uh, specific retention analyze various methods involved in artificial recharge of groundwater last one we have calculated the depth of water table using electrical resistivity method also write down assumptions so these are all super important questions from your engineering geology subject make sure these questions should be at your utmost priority and i wish you all the best for your examinations make sure you will share this video to all your friends and batchmates thank you